Hello guys, welcome to the channel again and in this quick tutorial video I'm gonna show you how to get your microphone muted when you're trying to record a voiceover recording in Adobe Premiere Pro. It will be real simple, it's gonna take a few seconds so let's go ahead and start the Adobe Premiere. And if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe and if you like this video please click that like button. Also click the notification bell so you don't miss new videos. Okay, so there we go. We just uh, want to click new project. Then we want to press OK. And I already have a file saved on the desktop. So I'm just going to load it up to the Adobe Premiere, which is down here. Just throw it in there. Then we want to throw it on the timeline. And as you can see here, this file's got a video track as well as it's got an audio track. We want to unlink this track by pressing Ctrl plus L. And it's going to be unlinked and then we can either delete it or we can mute it. This way we're not going to hear it. So let's just go ahead and mute it. You just got to press this M button here. Now it's muted. And if we want to record a new audio track on top of this video, let's say we want to just say have something recorded over. So let's just go ahead and try it out. Okay, I'm just gonna press the record button. And it's gonna count down. Three, one, two, three, two. one, two. Okay, so okay, guys, if so you like this guys, video, don't, like this forget, video, to don't forget to subscribe. And as you can see, I, I got this, I echo, got this in echo in the back. So, in the back so, so yeah, you can tell that there is an echo in the background. So we wanna get rid of it. And I'm gonna show you how to do it right now. So let's just go ahead and delete this track that we just recorded. And the first step we wanna do, we just gotta go to this edit menu. Then go all the way down to preferences and then choose audio. Uh, you can just choose mute input during timeline recording. Just gonna check this box here, click OK. And let's go ahead and try it again. Yeah guys, so if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel, hit that like button as well. Let's go ahead and check it out right now and see how it sounds. So let's go ahead and listen to it. Yeah guys, so if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel, hit that like button as well. Let's go ahead and check it out right now and see how it sounds. So as you can hear, it works way better. This first option works really good if you want to adjust the voice when you're recording it. If you have like a mixture or if you're a professional musician, you want to hear yourself. So that's why you want to adjust it at the same time. And for this reason, you got to use headphones. But if you don't need all that, you can just mute it. And this way you can just record your voice over without having to hear your echo in the background, which is really good. So I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.